Hello friends, Doug Fink back. Today I'm going to show you how to create cheat sheets using ChatGPT, my PowerShell A module. I'm sorry, my PowerShell AI module. And I'm going to then store them in Excel using my import Excel module. So if you like it, hit the thumbs up, hit the subscribe, and hit the notification. That way you'll know when I'm putting out more of these and you'll be notified. So let's get started. So here you can see uh, I'm typing in AI space, open double quotes, and typing in cheat sheet for PowerShell as a spreadsheet, close quotes. That'll go up to ChatGPT, make that request to the model, and it will come back with a result. I take that, type it into convert from hyphen GPT markdown table. That's part of the PowerShell AI module. Um, markdown comes back from GPT in a couple of different ways and this kind of homogenizes it and handles a couple of different formats to be able to convert it into a PowerShell array of objects with property names. And then last but not least, I type in, I pipe it into export Excel. So let's press enter and it'll go off to chat GPT and do its thing. So when it comes back, it provides a Excel spreadsheet and here's what it came up with for a cheat sheet in PowerShell. It's listing some basic uh, functions that exist in the built-in PowerShell, and it gives the actual description. So that's pretty cool. Now you can get more precise or you can get more verbose in what you pass up to the AI function. Instead of saying just cheat sheet for PowerShell as a spreadsheet, you can say, give me detailed stuff about Azure or something else and play around with that prompt to see what comes back. Let's do one more because this is not just about uh, PowerShell using AI and, or, and chat GPT. So now I'm going to type in AI open double quote cheat sheet for bash as a spreadsheet close double quotes and do the same thing I did before pipe it to convert from GPT markdown table and export and then pipe it into export Excel. Press enter. And that comes back with an Excel spreadsheet. And you can see it gives about 20 entries on some things you can do inside of Bash like PWD, uh, CP, MV, CAT, and so on. So just wanted to show you that. You can go off, go grab the PowerShell AI module. Uh, you have to have the import Excel module if you want to do it to Excel. You could do this and do the convert GPT markdown table and then put it into a text file or a CSV file or whatever you'd like or take out the, the convert from GPT markdown table and just copy the markdown and put it into a, an MD file and let something like Visual Studio Code render it. So go grab this, play around with different cheat sheets for different things you're working on, and um, it'd be awesome if you could let me know what you do, either in the comments below, or you can get onto the PowerShell AI uh, GitHub repo. I have a discussions open and you can share them there. It'd be great for me to see that as well as the community. Um, also in the, in the description below, I'll put links of how you can do the install on the PowerShell AI and where the repo is. So thanks for watching. Talk to you soon.